Have you ever felt like an imposter as a business coach? Or do you feel like it right now? Do you feel like an imposter as a business coach? Well, I'm here to help you with that. I'm Mark Nelson. I'm a former teacher turned online business coach, and I help teachers, entrepreneurs, coaches, and course creators make more money in their business. And that's all it's about. So how do you go from feeling like an imposter to feeling like you've actually made it. And I'm going to give you some hints for that. One, the, the imposter syndrome's out there for everybody. But how do you get confidence? Well, I tell you what I do every day. And you might have heard me say this before. As I get up early, I journal, and I write down what I'm grateful for every day. Three things. Talk about my day. Write what I'm grateful for. I write down my affirmations and I write them and read them. I visualize about where I'm headed because I'm trying to feel good about myself. And then I write down two or three things that I'm going to get done that day. But here's what you got to do. I mean, I'm a former basketball player. I small played small time basketball, college basketball, excuse me. Um, in Wisconsin, they have a, a state system of colleges. I played, I, I was a point guard. I was good. Um, and there was a way you had to show up. If I came into a game feeling really good about myself, my chest out, standing up tall, I played really well. But if I came into a game going, man, I don't know if I can do this. These guys are really good. I didn't play very well. So there's a couple things you got to do. Every day, you have to show up with energy. I mean, not just confidence, energy. Right, And then don't worry about what you're going to do. Just do your best. And guess what? Your best is going to get better all the time. Because if you're showing up, right, you're thinking about, okay, I got to put out content. I got to be, uh, people have to see me. I got to do videos. I got to do this. What am I going to do? And you start, everything starts acting like an overwhelm. Here's what you do. Show up with energy. Get people to believe in you. Make sure you act like you're successful. Right? Don't fake it till you make it. Just act like you're successful. See, when I played basketball, I came out going, I'm good. Even though the guy across from me might be better. He was going to be in for a game because I knew I could play. And that's the same thing as a coach. You have the goods to help anybody get through things what you're doing. You really do. So you got to start acting like it. Believe things are going to happen. Right? That's really what it is. You got to believe it. So go through, develop your morning routine. All right? Doesn't have to be hard. But again, here's what I do. And if you do that, great. I get up and one is I make sure I write down what I'm grateful for. And it, probably the same thing every day. I'm grateful for my wife. We have a great dog. We're grateful for my, our dog, Mako. We live in an RV on the lake. I'm grateful where we live. I'm a colon cancer survivor. So I'm really grateful for my health. I'm grateful for my kids. I mean, I start writing these things down, they just flow, and I write them down every day. Then I write down my affirmations. Right? I'm blessed. I'm worthy. I am lucky. I am a client attracting machine. I attract money in abundance. I just go through, I have a list about 20 of my list every day. Large sums of money come to me quickly and easily from multiple sources on a consistent basis for the good of all, and I get to keep. I attract quality clients quickly and easily from multiple sources on a consistent basis for the good of all. Those are my affirmations. And the more I say them, guess what? The more I believe them. So everybody has the imposter syndrome, right? So if you feel like an imposter is a business coach, you have to do the work to get by it. Start acting like you believe it. Start acting like you already there. Start going to work learning more. And just know, see, here's what it's all about. It's all about serving people. Don't worry about if you think you're good or not. Worry about how you can show people a transformation in their business, in their life. And when that starts taking the forefront of everything, you are not an imposter in your coaching business. You are the real deal. Hey, 
Put in the comments below, have you ever felt like an imposter? Do you battle imposter syndrome? Just put it in the comments. If you got value from this, right, please share with your friends. If you're on YouTube, subscribe. If you're seeing this or listening to this on my podcast, follow it. But if you want to set up a free strategy call, marknelsononline.com forward slash call. Set up the time. We'll talk and we'll make things happen. Y'all take care.